Hello from the Laborers Health and Safety Fund of North America. I'm Emily Smith, Health Promotion Manager here at the Fund. Today I want to discuss colds, the flu, and COVID-19, and how you can protect yourself this fall and winter. That sneezing, sore throat, cough, and headache you have may be the start of a cold. Or is it the flu? Colds and the flu are common illnesses that almost everyone will face at some point. While many symptoms of the common cold and flu are similar, the treatments are different. Most people get colds in the winter and spring, but they can happen at any time of year. If your symptoms began over the course of a few days, you may have a cold. If you think you have a cold, see your doctor if symptoms get worse or last for more than two weeks. Over-the-counter treatments include antihistamines, decongestants, and non-steroidal anti-inflammatories like ibuprofen. Non-medication treatments include getting plenty of rest, drinking fluids, gargling with warm salt water, and using cough drops. Unlike a cold, the flu comes on suddenly. Symptoms are more severe and can last from a few days to two weeks. The flu season typically starts in October, peaks in the winter months, and can last as late as May. The flu and COVID-19 cause similar symptoms, including fever, cough, fatigue, body aches, headache, sore throat, and a runny or stuffy nose. With both viruses, it's possible to have no symptoms and still spread the virus to others. This is known as being asymptomatic. If you think you have the flu or COVID-19, see your doctor to confirm the diagnosis. If you do have the flu, your doctor will likely prescribe an antiviral medication. Most people recover from the flu without complications. However, it can lead to bronchitis, sinus infections, ear infections, and pneumonia. The flu can also make certain conditions like asthma, COPD, diabetes, and heart disease worse. The best way to reduce your risk for getting the flu is to get your flu shot. The best way to reduce your risk for COVID-19 is to get vaccinated. The CDC recommends that most people six months of age and older get the flu vaccine by the end of October. If you have specific questions, reach out to the Fund's Health Promotion Division or leave us a comment below. Thanks and stay safe out there!